It's Angela with Chick Fix, and I wanted to talk to you guys real quick this week about your garbage disposal. It's Thanksgiving week, a lot of us are going to be cooking, and um, you're cooking away, you got your potato peels and your carrot peels and all that stuff, you jam it all down there, you flip on the switch, and it clogs up or it jams up. And you think, oh my god, I got people coming over here in an hour, and I still have to shower, and now my sink's all clogged up, what am I going to do? The first thing is, don't panic. Second thing is, don't do that. Don't try to jam everything down there and expect those blades to spin because they won't. Uh, so what you need to do, first turn off your disposal. Make sure that's off. You don't want anything wrong going there. Um, now get in there, pull out any of the uh, stuff that you've put down in there. You can use tongs for that if you want. You can use your hands, but be forewarned that there are sharp things down there. So be careful if you're going to do that. And once you've done that, take a look and see if you can see what might be jamming it up. Next thing you can do is try to take a wooden spoon end of it, jam it down in there, and kind of see if you can turn around the, um, turn the blades manually uh, and see if you can get it unstuck that way. Now, if that doesn't work, then I have another trick for you. So, this one time at my house, I got a paper clip stuck in my garbage disposal. And this is how I fixed that. So, come follow me under my sink. All right, now, underneath the sink, this is a reset button. You may or may not need to use that. Um, if it doesn't turn back on for you for some reason, then, you know, try hitting that button. Kind of like a control alt delete. Now, you got a hex bolt in here. Y'all know I love my Allen wrenches. All right, you gotta find the right size. All right, and you're gonna twist back and forth, back and forth. Now, what this does is it twists the, in the, the you're actually manually turning the uh, blades on the inside so you can actually kind of feel if something is jammed and and you might actually feel the moment that you unjam it uh, so kind of be looking for that now once you finish that come back up here take a look in the disposal see if you can figure out what it is that was jamming it up if it was food maybe you can clear it out if it was a paper clip you might actually see it or a, a bobby pin or something like that um, so and then once you feel like you've gotten it kind of moving again, try flipping on the switch and turning the water back on. Now, if it doesn't come back on after that, you might have a bigger problem and um, I may have to do a separate video about that. But hopefully that helps everybody. Hope you guys have a great Thanksgiving and look for my next video on Chick Fix.